my channel Phonics Craft. So in today's video, I'm gonna show you how you can DIY this miniature Tinkerbell keychain. And it's very easy. You just have to take few things with you, sit and make this. That's all. So for this, you will need craft wire, tissue papers, glitter paper, paints, old keychain and glue so let's get started so as you can see i've taken three different wires over here and it's of different sizes one is just the half of the long one and the second one is half and a little bit more so this is the measurement now to make the body of the tinkerbell i'll just take the wires and connect them with a cello tape Now the second one also. Cello tape will help it be in its place properly and it will secure. So now I'll just take a plier and shape it in a correct posture and then make a loop on the head of the Tinkerbell. So this will be the loop where the keychain will get connected. Now I have taken a white tissue paper and I will just cut some strips out of it. Now I will just start rolling and covering the body of the Tinkerbell. So it will give the volume. So guys you just need few coats of tissue paper to give it a good shape of a body because you have to hide the wire and also the wire will help you bend the body parts of the Tinker Fairy very well. So for the thighs I'll just put some more coats of the tissue paper so it can get thick enough if you know what I'm saying. So I'll just keep on covering the body parts like this, first the legs, then the hands and then the body. So guys, this process will take some time but trust me after it's done, it will look really very good and it will look just like a doll. Sometimes we don't get our desired keychains from the market so you can make any type of doll you want and it's good for decoration also. You can put it on your bags and on your the keys, keys of your house, the cars. So it's very easy. Now for the body I'll just keep on rolling the tissue till it gets thick. So now for the head I'll just take my tissue and crush it like this and keep on putting on the head part. And now for the shoes also, I'll just crush the tissue paper into tiny pieces and attach on the end of the legs like this and also on the hands. Now for the head bun, I'll just use some crushed news, uh, tissue paper more and it's done. Now for the more detailing, I'll keep on putting some tissue paper crushed rolls on the shoes on the hands and as you can see it's done and you can keep it to get dried for an hour and then start painting so for the bees i'm just using some basic colors of the tinkerbell so for the skin i'll just paint it in a light creamish color Now for the hairs, I'll just, because she is blonde, so I'll just use some golden and yellowish paint. And for the shoes, I'll just paint it the green color she has on her dress. And some white paint for the pom-poms. Now for the facial uh, expressions, I'll just paint that also, eyes and the lips. 
Now for the dress, as you can see, I've taken a glitter paper and made some cutouts of it like this. So these leaf shapes will be for the skirt of the Tinkerbell. She wears a dress basically. So we'll just make it of two parts and start attaching them. Now for the top also, I'll just put the cutout and stick it. So as you can see, it's completed now. Now for the you know wings, I've taken a translucent sheet and made a cutout of a wing, and then just apply some of the silver glitter dust on the wings so that it will be completed. Now as you can see, we've used some craft wires for the body so it can easily bend and move their hands and legs. So you can put it on any size, any shape like you want. So after giving the desired shape, you will just take the hot glue gun and put the wings on the body. Now I will just paint the loop black. It is already a black craft wire but still to give it a more shine, I am painting it with a brick paint and then I am taking my black uh, keychain holder and I will just attach to the loop and as you can see it is done guys. This is the final keychain and trust me it's look, it looks very cute. So I will definitely use this. So guys if you want to make something like this, any Tinker Fairies or Princess doll, you can surely use this method. So guys I hope you liked my video. If you did please make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And make sure you hit the bell icon so that whenever I post a new video you will be notified. Till next time. Bye.